Tenerife is the largest of Spain's Canary Islands. Home to around one million people, it welcomes five million tourists each year. Many will visit Teide National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, which is home to the third largest volcano in the world, Mount Teide. Laura Castro is Director of Tourism for Tenerife. We have the best climate in the world and obviously the whole year good weather, sunsets, magnificent sunsets and uh, best landscapes and nature where you can enjoy uh, long days and of course practicing sport. And sport is the reason around 100 guests were visiting the island in October this year for the 2022 World Corporate Golf Challenge. The event unites business with golf as two company employees represent their nation in the world final. However, it was not the only competition taking place in Tenerife that week, as WCGC chairman Jose Guerra explains. A few years ago, we started to develop a concept called the Sport Legends Cup, which is a way of entertaining our customers, our, our licenses, media, sponsors, authorities that is supporting us and they are part of our community. So we create this Sport Legends Cup with the idea of having one legend play with three of our guests. The hotel hosting the golfers and sport legends sits in a prime location on the south coast of Tenerife. Saad Azsam is general manager of the Gran Malia Palacio de Asura. I met Jose about uh, two years now and um, I loved the idea because this island is heaven for golfers. So it's going to be an amazing experience for them, uh, I'm sure, and I'm very happy to have them here and be the venue for this big uh, event. Because I'm a golfer myself, I love golf, and so uh, it attracts me very much. And Saad was one of the golfers out on course playing in the Sports Legends Cup, grouped with former NFL star and Super Bowl champion Ryan Pickett. Man, this course is spectacular. It's tough but it's the views, everything is amazing. The people are amazing, it's hosting it. Um, couldn't ask for a better place to be right now. It's been fun, man. It's meeting the guys and playing with a group of guys I never played with. Um, it's been a joy. I mean, the people are so nice and they treat you so well. It's like the best event I've been in and I, I played in the hundreds of events in the States, but this is probably the top. Also playing with the Green Bay Packers legend was Michael Schneider, Chief Revenue Officer at Fortune magazine. We have been involved in this event for a number of years and it's been a terrific event. Uh, both I've enjoyed myself a ton and met some really wonderful people, great business contacts and uh, look forward to continuing. The Sports Legends Cup took place at the Obama Golf Course. Opened in 2005, Obama has been named as one of the top golf resorts in Europe. Brendan Breen is the general manager. Oh, it's a very challenging course. Um, in fact, it's, it's quite a difficult course. Uh, designed by Dave Thomas, uh, he decided to try to design the Augusta of Europe. Uh, so we have a lot of plateau greens, uh, undulating with a lot of movement, and they're very fast. Um, there's some spectacular holes on the course because basically the course runs from uh, 50 meters above sea level up to 320 meters above sea level. So the, you can nearly see the Atlantic Ocean and La Gomera from nearly every hole on the golf course. Also boasting world-class tennis facilities, the Obama Resort offers deluxe holiday villas and residences. We're a luxury development. We don't uh, aim particularly at a volume market. The clients who come to Obama Golf uh, feel a little bit different. They have a, a, a personal service, uh, buggies personalized with their names and their tea times, uh, special items like water and fruit when they go out on the golf course. So we look after our clients when they come here. Out on the challenging golf course were the likes of former Irish footballer Stephen Staunton, Spanish tennis player Francisco Clave, and French rugby star Abdel Latif Benazi. Joining them and the other contestants in the Sports Legends Cup was Portuguese soccer player Nuno Valente. This golf course is amazing and uh, I think one of the best golf course I play. And uh, congratulations for organization. 
was to the people the um, coming here to enjoy this fantastic island. At the closing awards dinner, the team of former Real Madrid footballer Isidoro San Jose were named day one winners. Futsal player Jose Ruiz and his group were crowned Sports Legends Cup victors on day two. It all brought to a close a special week in Tenerife.